Hey, welcome back. Uh, Jay Nichols here at the Caddis Fly Shop. I'm going to show you the components you can use with your three basic types of tubes when you're tying a tube fly. And these basically consist of a hook guide, like this right here, that will help hold your hook in place. Or it could be a weight that would add, uh, add some density to your fly to help it sink a little bit faster. Or it could be a cone or a bead to finish the front of the fly. So, hook guide, weight, cone, bead for finishing. Let me show you how these are attached. If you're using a if you're using a nanotube, you will need one of these hook guides. They're silicone sleeves. They fit on the back of the nanotube. And of course, they come in many colors. This is pink. They come in orange. And, and they come in, the tube is the same size but the hook guide, this little silicone sleeve, they have large, medium, and small to accommodate different sizes of hooks. Um, <clears throat> this, is a, this is a large, they come in extra large as well. So this, this will accommodate your hook. Um, for a weight, there are many kinds of weights. This is a raw tungsten weight. and it slides down the tube. Of course, there are many different kinds of uh, weights you can use. They come in colors, they come in shapes and sizes, uh, but they all serve the function of adding density to help your, fly, your tube fly sink faster. And then you have the finish component. This is an ultrasonic disc. Uh, this is a bead. This is a plastic cone. We have uh, metallic cones. By the way, these, this is automotive grade painting. It's good stuff. So these go on the front of the fly to help finish them off. And the wonderful thing about the Pro Sport Fisher system is that all of these beads, cones, weights, they all fit on these tubes. Uh, this, again, the, 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 the nanotube, the 4040, and the classic. Every one of their cones, every one of their weights, every one of their beads, all fit on these tubes. And that makes them just wonderfully easy to work with. Now in a separate video, I will show you how to actually seat the hook uh, in these various kinds of tubes. Thank you for joining us.